Yeah. On the podium again at the Dauphiné, what, what's the feeling? How do you look back at your, your week overall? Yeah, proud. I think it was a really, really good race for me. I, uh, I actually enjoyed it a lot and it's nice to feel, uh, feel good again at the front of a race. First Australian too. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Was a challenge. I won the won the Perth Cup. Jai was fourth, so it was close between us. Uh, uh, it's actually sweet. I think Jack. I don't know where Jack Haig finished. Was he fifth in the end? If so, that's three Aussie guys in the top five, which is really really impressive. Uh, I think it talks a lot about Australian cycling and how um, how this kind of generation of ours is really improving and really fighting with the best. Uh, that's for the so on track for the tour. Well, what's what's your thoughts about that? Yeah. Yeah, I'm on track for the tour. Uh, hopefully, you can just get through it more or less all in a good way and um, can fight my best and see if I can be in the top 10 again. Um, yeah, I don't really know what else to really to say. Um, it's, a, it's a week of, well, it's three weeks of stories and you never know which way it's going to turn. So I just hope to get through the whole Tour de France, you know, safely without too much complication and be able to race at my best level. And if I end up being fifth or eighth or fourth or third, yeah, I'll take whatever. What remains to do now before the, the start of Bilbao? Oh, I'm going to have a couple of days easy and drink a couple of beers to relax and then and then got a little bit of work before uh, before we kickstart the, the tour. So it's two and a half weeks. Yeah, I'm going to enjoy the next uh, two or three days really easy. Thank you, man. Well done. Thank you very much.